Okay, so I wanna quickly show you a grocery haul. I said on my Instagram, what do you wanna see more of or whatever, so grocery haul was one of them. I'm gonna show you what we got. This is Wednesday. I actually don't have an Ocado delivery till tomorrow. I literally, I don't know, it's everyone's panic buying or just using up slots, but it took me a week and a half to get a slot with Ocado. Um, not too much of a big deal. We usually kind of shop every two weeks for like stuff, but, um, yeah, Graham got this stuff from the farmer's market, the green grocer, and also he popped a Lidl as well, which he tends to do a lot after when he does like the market run. So I'm gonna show you the bits that he got from Lidl first. Um, our ultimate favorite, we always get a box of these every week, the chocolate seashells, so good. They're only about two pound, under three pounds for the box. Nice little weekend treat or Friday night. And then I picked up these a couple weeks ago and now Graham seems to pick them up every time. I think they're 59p a pack. The fruit and nut is like, that's like, I love dairy milk fruit and nut and that is in a cookie and it's amazing. You can see it's like chocolate covered on one side and then Graham likes the chocolate chunk ones. And then he randomly picked up the breaded camembert with cranberry dip. Never seen this before in there, but actually it's something that I have ordered before, like in a restaurant. Um, I have no idea how much it was, but he just picked up that. Cloudy apple juice is one thing that he really likes, as well as Pepsi Max. Apparently it's cheaper in Lidl than most places, so that's why he tends to get it from there. And then he also picked up some body wash and foam bath for Miles. He baths Miles, so he knows when it runs out, pretty much. So he said they're getting low, so he got that. Um, the crisping cake... Um, ice creams, they remind me of the Maxi Bonds. I love these, everyone loves these actually. They're nice to keep in the freezer, as a nice little treat. Um, sweet potato fries are something that we have often as a side. And then also the Halloween Mallows. They've obviously got their Halloween stuff out. Some of the Nutella stuff filled donuts. It's our little Wednesday after dinner treat. And then also some kitchen towel. I do actually have some in the food delivery tomorrow, but he also got some. Okay, I'm gonna start off over here. So this with the grapes and the strawberries is from the green grocer. So it's just the fruit box. Uh, the kids have already attacked it. So we've got like half the grapes left. Um, but yeah, just some of the new forest. They look really good actually, considering they're out of season now. Um, yeah, so peaches, plums, pears, kiwis, um, oranges, bananas, grapes, and strawberries for the fruit box. And then over here is just all the extra bits that Graham picks up from the farmer's market. In here, there's loads of stuff that I need to get out. Oranges, more peaches, avocados, apples, pears, normal carrots, um, uh, onion. Um, this usually goes to the rabbits, the um, cabbage thing. And then we've got cucumber, more bunch of carrots. The rabbits love these bits. Um, two lots of broccoli, honeydew melon, we've got some kale, a bag of spinach, um, sweet potato, some peppers mixture, and then also some blueberries, some more greener bananas, some more plums, some strawberries that really don't look that great, they're tiny. Um, and then also some chestnut mushrooms. And yeah, so that is pretty much the fruit and veggies for this week, which isn't too bad. Okay, so I have just received my Ocado delivery. I'm so disappointed. I feel like I'm missing a bag. The stuff that I've ordered that had definitely is in here, or I've got one of it, when the offer's like two or three or something. Um, I'm really annoyed. And also, to top it off, one of my bottles has no lid. Perfect, just what I needed. So I'm gonna have to sort that out. I'm just gonna have to like, you can, you can actually sort things out on the uh, website, which is quite, it's quite speedy, the way they refund you and whatever, but I am just, I'm more disappointed about it. I've never experienced it before. Anyway, this is a really hodgepodge, random barrel of stuff. Um, and it is a Thursday, so we're kind of at the end of the week now. Um, so anyway, I can't remember how much these were, but these were on offer. Two coconut and the pilau rice. We're going to have curry tonight. Um, these 
uh, the coconut one's mine and Violet's favourite, and then I've got Pilaf for the boys. I've also got a couple of extras in the cupboard. I just like buying them when they're on offer because the Tilda stuff can be more expensive. Um, I ordered two bags of crisps. The other bag was roast chicken, but I got the cheese and onion flavour only. They were half price. The mini popper dums are for the curry tonight. I got the kids some of these little Oreo thins. Please excuse Miles in the background. <laughs> and then the yo yo's apple were also, these were actually on offer, so I got a pack of those. These are like lunchbox snacks or after school snacks. Okay, so I got the King's Meal thins, the whole meal. I ordered two packs, I've only received one pack. Um, I also ordered the pretzel thins. I just really wanted to try these dipped in hummus. Um, having said that, I, oh, I have got the hummus, that's good. So I ordered the Bake at Home white petty pans. Um, this is for a little bit of a Sunday evening treat. I'll show you in a minute what I got with that. And then me and Graham are going away for a night on Saturday night with the baby as well for a belated 40th birthday thing. Um, I'm just taking a few little nibbles. So um, these were 99p a bag. So I got the crispy bacon and maple syrup crisps. And then also the sweet chili and sour cream. They sounded so good. I haven't tried either of these. And I, I'm doing like a little hamper for Graham for like a belated birthday for while we're away. So I ordered, I ordered two of the Sensation mixes, that nuts mix. I got the Mexico City, which is the ones I ordered, but I also ordered the honey glaze ones, and I've only received one pack. Um, tonight, it's Friday night. No, tomorrow, it's Friday night movie night, so um, I already bought us some little chocolate treats for our movie night. These were two for two pounds. I'm also going to be doing some chicken frankfurters wrapped um, in puff pastry. And then I also got a roast in the bag, extra tasty. I've had this before, it's really nice. Um, and I quite like just cooking it and using it. Sometimes just for lunches, but I think I'll probably do a meal and then leftovers for like lunches. So I've got that. I've got Grim, um, the orange and pineapple squash. They're always on offer and he's nearly running out. I've got the Persil 3-in-1 capsules. These were a pack of 50 for eight pounds. I do like the person on by. They're probably my favourite, like scent-wise as well. It's just really clean and fresh. Um, I've got the Dolmio No Added Sugar Bolognese. I always have these in as backup just for anything, really. I use these this week with um, spaghetti and meatballs just as a quick sauce. Um, tin of green lentils. Again, I love throwing this into like a bolognese. Just adds a bit extra, um, you know, and... Just it make, just makes it extra tasty, I find, even like a lasagna. Right, so I've got some mild curry paste. I did actually order the korma curry paste, but that was a sub. Um, so yeah, that should be fine though. So that's for my curry. Mozzarella, because I usually make homemade pizza. I probably make homemade pizza on Monday now. Um, and then I bought some whole milk, um, mainly for Miles to try. Um, yeah, just just trying to get him used to a little bit of whole milk, really. Um, so yeah, I got the Yeo Valley one. I got the two Oat Barista editions. These were on offer, as you can see. One of them is missing a lid. Um, I got Miles, the Fromage Fraise, the M&S versions, these apricot, raspberry, and strawberry. Thought he could give them a go. And then I got the kids some of the um, yogurt tubes. I also got some Greek style yogurt, which we all like some medium cheddar slices. Um, I've been making the bacon and broccoli carbonara recently. Absolutely love it. And this is the cheese that you use in it. So um, yeah, I got some more of that because I've run out. Got some puff pastry because it's good for like everything at the moment. Quick and easy pizzas, like pizza swirls. I'm gonna use them with the Frankfurters as a really fun quick meal for the kids. Um, got some hummus, President Camembert, this is going to be like our Sunday ness um, with the petty pans. Another thing I've noticed that I've missed, I ordered some crackers. I did. I ordered some crackers. I don't have those either. Um, got some wafer thin ham. And then my also sub was they were doing a pack of six Heinz beans, no added sugar, for £3. So they've subbed me for four single cans, which... 
actually is more expensive to have four individual cans. Um, but the gentleman took off two of the cans for me, as in like the price. So that was quite nice of him to do that. Um, because it generally works out a lot more, more expensive anyway. And also the, the six pack was a deal. And then lastly, I got some broccoli and Stilton soup, which I love. And actually the kids demolished it last, last weekend. So um, I thought I'd get another one of that as well. So yeah, that is my very small limited Ocado delivery. Yeah, really disappointed to be perfectly honest. There's certain things I just wanted and ah, oh, now I'm gonna have to go through the hassle of like sorting it out, like ringing them up and you know, especially like having no lid on that one and just missing things, especially because they're all on deals and it makes me think am I paying the full price just for one instead of getting the deal for two so I'm gonna have to look it's gonna take time you know what I mean I've got to look through my delivery my order details um and also I'm gonna have to pop to the shop to get to those bits that I wanted which is defeats the whole point of getting a bloody delivery um but I will tell you some meals that we've had this week we had spaghetti and meatballs this week we've had toad in the hole I did a really quick meal yesterday, like I just a frozen oven meal yesterday. It was just one of those days. Tonight we're having chicken curry, which we love. Um, tomorrow, I don't know if I'm going to do homemade pizza tomorrow. All those little Halloween um, sort of twirly things, um, hot dog things. Um, and then Saturday we're actually away anyway for one night. And then Sunday... Um, I plan on doing the cheese with breads and crackers and the kids love that. Like kind of like um, help yourself nibbly, you know, I do like some veggies and stuff and some fruit. Um, yeah, I really hope you enjoyed this video. Um, and yeah, I will see you in my next one and hopefully it won't be as disastrous as this one. <laughs> okay, so I just wanted to add this on because I've just worked out, I've gone online just worked out all the missing items that I have from Ocado this week. Nine missing items. Nine. I, I reckon the delivery man has obviously not given me two bags of my order. Or they just weren't packed. I don't know. But, um, yeah, I thought I would just add that because that's a lot of items. <laughs> now I'm going to have to go to the shop. <laughs> Isn't it? Yep. Annoying.